Hey, Summit, this is Edward. You know this guy. It's Jay Connor. Good morning, Summit Land. Uh, hey, real quick, share this on all your platforms, uh, Facebook, YouTube, uh, wherever you LinkedIn. have. LinkedIn. Uh, if you want to put a vi uh, big screen in your front yard, show it in your front yard, that kind of deal. Yeah. I saw that happen in our neighborhood a couple nights oh, ago. Oh, cool. Hey, real quick, let us mention a couple things. One is this Sunday we are going to start communion again, and we'll have that every week in our service again to I worship like together. It. It'll be in different places in the service, so uh, going to keep you guessing a little bit. That's right. Uh, so they got to come. Hey, to Sundays find have out. been good though, man. Has been good. Last week the integrity message, man, it 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 really it really got to me. In fact. If I've got a couple of minutes, I want to share a few things that the Lord's impressed upon me this week after that great message. Because, you know, integrity, your insides matching your outsides, you know, do what you say. And you said something about being the real you. And I, I just don't feel like I've been living in integrity. And so I wrote down a few things in my quiet time that the I believe the Lord has wanted me to share with Summit Land so that I can be in integrity with you, Edward. So if you'll indulge me for just a second. Number one. A lot of people don't know this about me because I've been hiding it. I love Caesar salad. And I know that's a bad thing because Caesar in the Bible was not a good guy. And, you know, uh, he was like a god to the Romans. But, man, and I've been hiding the fact that I like Caesar salad because of that. Is this going to be like a 20-minute video? But if I'm going to be in integrity, you need to know I like Caesar Is this salad. Is going to be like a 20-minute video? Number two, when I travel, I stop and get gas at Pilate. I know Pontius Pilate's the one that turned Jesus over to be crucified. But, I mean, they've got the best prices, and they serve those pizzas inside. And, you know, anyway, number, number three, I really don't like fishing. I know. How can you be a disciple of Jesus and not like fishing? Because most of his disciples were fishermen. Does that mean you're going to give me that rod and reel? Man, I've been living a lie. This feels so good to get this out. Number four, I like cats. I know I pretend not to like cats. I tell people I don't like cats. I've been living a lie that's not of integrity. The, the, the critters aren't so bad. Uh, and the last two things, number one, I hate flying monkeys off Wizard of Oz, if you've ever seen that movie, and China Dolls. Those things scare me to death. Oh, this feels good. Living in integrity, getting all this out, letting people know the real me. Feel good, man. Feel real, real good. What we got this Sunday? Amazing. So this Sunday we are going to do communion, and uh, we'll continue in our series, and maybe Jake will have some more confession. I don't know. Okay, okay, uh, okay, you got me. You don't have to shame me. There's one more thing. This one's going to be tough. I enjoy a good bubble bath. I've heard that. Yeah. It's, heard I that. call them man baths. Mm -hmm. You know, after a long day of mowing, rough day on the mm -hmm. golf course, your legs are sore, throw some you know, Epsom salt in there. To, you used to take care of our dogs when we traveled, but you took a bath and I bathtub did do that. and we I changed the locks on our house. I did do that one time back uh, when we was both living at the ranch. Mm -hmm. so. We changed the locks on our Summit, house. Summit, if that. you're struggling in your integrity, you want to get some things off your chest, I'm telling you, this is one of the most freeing things I've ever done. So um, don't forget we are doing communion this Sunday and uh, the following uh, month, uh, November the 1st, we're going to be opening up preschool and it. children's area. And uh, Jake's going to talk a little bit about that, but before he does, the uh, last Sunday of this month, we are offering our membership oh, class. I'm so excited to get back to offering and, membership on um, a regular basis. You know, it's interesting. Um, I, I kind of want to say something about your integrity, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to walk away from that. If you're wondering what Summit is about, this would be a great way for you to do that. Uh, sign up for that. You can send an email to Paula or Jake. Uh, make reservations so we'll know you're coming, and uh, they'll let you know where that class is going to happen in our building. Now, Jake, we still have our store open yeah. for nursery children. We're redoing our whole wing. The store is going to be extended until Sunday, so you have through Sunday to get on that Amazon store. Uh, order those items, bless the preschool, and bless the children's area as Ashley and Kristen get ready to reopen that. Still need more volunteers. We've got background checks and forms at the info desk on Sunday. They can pick up, fill those out, get now those had, to Ashley and Kristen. We had a lot of people Kristen. sign up. 
Is that right? Yeah. I mean, we've had a good response. I mean, That's yeah, we're, you guys. we're getting you there. You guys are awesome. We're getting there. I uh, got one more thing here. Uh, grief support this Sunday. That's right. That's so, right. uh, second Sunday of every month, grief support meets right after the 11 a.m. service. Uh, Jenny and uh, Tomasa, they, they run a great, great ministry there. So, if you know somebody that's grieving, been struggling during this time of COVID, or you've got a, had a loss in your family, man, that's a great ministry to get plugged into. No doubt. No doubt. Uh, the last thing I would mention is, is uh, last week, several of you came forward on our media. Uh, team, we're still looking for a few of those, and uh, if you would like to be a part of that, please get with me this week after church or before the service. Uh, we can hook you up with those folks and get you on the uh, rotation for that. Uh, real excited about what's going on back there, Jake, and how oh, things good. are happening online and whatnot. So, hey, Sam, it's been an interesting update today. Uh, hey, I noticed that Danielle's working today, and you've got a lunch appointment at Red Rooster, I do. so the house will I be do. open for a little bit? I, we do, we, I will lock it today. Come over um, here and take a bath before I- will lock I, it today <laughs> and um, it will be locked up tight. I'm, I um, mean, this is so freeing, man, living in integrity. <sighs> wow. Well, hey, share this on your platforms, guys. We love you. Got anything else? I'm scared to ask. Uh, no, I'm good. Um, whew, man, we love you. We'll see you Sunday, nine o'clock, 11 o'clock. Don't be late. It's gonna be good. See you Summit.